Hello and welcome. Start off in a comfortable seated position. Let's take a couple moments to just settle in, bring awareness to our breath and to our body for the next 25 minutes. We're going to let go of everything else and just focus on some self-care, setting yourselves up for success in whatever is next today. Place the backs of your hands on your knees. Close your eyes and let's begin with five slow breaths. Inhale. Exhale. Breath in through your nose. Exhale through your mouth. As you breathe in, sitting a little taller. As you exhale, feeling the connection with your foundation. Two more breaths here. Inhale. Exhale. The last one, breath in. Breath out. Open your eyes. Take your left hand up and over your head to your right ear. Take your right hand, fingertips to the mat or ground beside so you, propping them up. Breath in, sit tall. Exhale to your left. Continuing the cycle of ease, awareness, long breaths here. This is pretty intense for the side of your neck, all the way down to your arm, to your wrist, and your fingertips. One more breath in, breath out, release your hand from your ear, bring it over to the mat, extend it out to the fingertips, the thumb, second, third, fourth, fifth fingers are all making contact with the mat, then sweep your right hand up and over your head, placing it lightly over your ears, breath in, and breath out, allow yourself to stretch out to your right side. Slow breaths, breath in. making the sound of the ocean. Breath in. Breath out. One more here. As you exhale, releasing your fingertips from your ears, placing them on the mat beside you. Breath in. Exhale. Take a moment to wiggle here. Do what you need to do. And then we're going to take it to child's pose. So from the back of your mat, bring your knees to the outside edges. Toes touch. And slowly bring your body forward. So arms lead the way. Reach, reach. Reach, reach, and then forehead on the mat. On 
each inhale, stretch those fingertips a little bit active towards the front of your mat. On each exhale, sink your hips towards the floor and towards the back of the mat. Finding ease here for three more breaths. Now make your way into tabletop. So basically you're on all fours. Shoulders are gonna be above your wrists, hips above your knees. Knees are hip width apart. Ankles are hip width apart. Take a moment to set it up. And we're going into cat and cow. So we are synchronizing our breath with a warm up of the spine. As we inhale, we look up. As we exhale, look towards your belly button and around your back. Breath in. Exhale. Two more. back to tabletop. I want to do a little bit of a side cat cow. See if you can inhale as you look towards your right hip. Actually, exhale. Inhale in the center. Exhale, left hip. Inhale, center. Exhale to your right. Inhale to the center. Exhale to your left. Nice and easy. Nice and slow. One more time on each side. To the right. Center, fill up, and exhale to the left. Back to center, excellent. Bring your left arm slightly to the center. Raise your right hand up. We're going into thread the needle, inhale, Exhale as you bring your right shoulder to the mat. You can readjust your left palm. I like to take my twist a little further, looking towards the ceiling. Hips remain lifted. I'm pretty active pushing my left palm into the ground to provide a little bit more twist. Yet at the same time, not fighting gravity, allowing my right shoulder to really sink into the floor. Now 
And one more breath in. One more breath out. On your next in inhale, push up, going out the way we came in, reaching our right arm up, looking up, and coming back to tabletop. Breath here. Inhale. Exhale. Shifting your weight onto our right hand. Extending the left hand up to the ceiling as we look up, reach up, breathe in. Exhale, thread the needle, left shoulder to the mat. Adjusting your right hand so you can get a good grip on the floor. Get a little bit more of a twist. Keep those hips raised. Gaze comes towards the ceiling as you are able. Long breaths. Do this for your body. Do this for your mind. One more breath in. On your next inhale, pushing into your right palm, lifting up. Inhale as you reach your left arm up to the ceiling. Exhale, it to the mat, tabletop. Breath in, breath out. Tuck your toes and just lift your knees. A little bit of a core here. We'll stay here for five breaths. If you need to, you can take a rest. I mean, right back in. You got this. One more breath in. Exhale, knees to the mat. Raise your hips. Downward facing dog. Head between your arms. Gaze looks to the space between your feet. Chin is relaxed, the jaw is relaxed, shoulders are relaxed. Hands are open wide, distributing the weight equally amongst all your fingers. Maybe walking your dog a little bit, lifting your heels, alternating to stretch out those hamstrings. Your heels don't have to touch the floor. If they do, that's great, but don't worry if they don't. Lifting onto your toes. Sinking your heels down. Let's do that two more times. Breath in, lift up. Breath out, ground down. Oh, one more breath in, raise those heels. Exhale, lower your heels and start to walk your hands back towards your feet. All little motions. Find ragdoll. Grip your opposite elbows. Drop your head. Slight bend in the knees. Perhaps swing from side to side. We're playing with your balance, bringing your weight into your toes and then your heels. Entire upper body limp, relaxed allowing gravity to do the work for you. One more breath in. Exhale, let go of your elbows, fingertips to the floor, 
and coming up for five, four, three, two, one. Nicely done. Shoulders roll back. Let's do some stretches for our upper body. Allow your stance to be on the wider side, say hip width apart. We're going to reach both arms up overhead, grasp your fingers together, and then turn them up towards the ceiling. So your palms are facing the ceiling. Release your thumbs, and thumbs are gonna lead the way down in front of us. Nice and slow. This is a pretty intense stretch. Keep breathing. When you're at shoulder height, release, relax, reset. Going to do it again, but this time you're going to switch your grip. So if normally your left thumb is over, it's going to be gripping so your right thumb is over. There we go. Grip and reaching up and overhead. Take the opposite grip. Then turn your palms to the ceiling. Thumbs lead the way down. It's going to take a few breaths. Take it slow. Big stretch between your pinkies and your thumbs. When you have it at shoulder height, stay here for one breath. Gently release, relax, reset. Tree pose. Tree pose is the quintessential yoga pose. Everyone's like, oh, yoga. Tree pose. Well, yeah, it's a great one. So you will take your balance into your left leg. And then your right leg can stay at the ankle. Can stay at the lower leg. Or you can pull it above the knee. Please don't place it on the knee. Above or below the knee will be fine. Again, you have several options. All of these are good. Take a moment to set your balance. And then you have options for your hands. You can hold them at the heart center and pray your bows. You can lift them up, grow your branches to the side. You can connect your fingers and you press your palms to the ceiling. You can do reverse prayer, so it's this behind my back. Finding a small smile on your face, staying with it if you fall out, coming right back in. One more breath. And release. Relax. Reset. We're going to take it to the other side. Bringing your weight to your right foot, taking your left foot to the ankle or to the lower leg. Staying here if that's where you're at today or bringing it up above the knee. Whatever you did on your other side, finding the equal balance today. So prayer pose or reverse prayer whichever one you chose, or perhaps cycle through all of them. Staying here, Focus, focusing on the non-moving spot ahead of you helps. Recognizing that a tree in the wind is flexible and it does move around, that's okay. A couple breaths here, one more. And slowly release. Relax. 
Reset. Nicely done. So let's do one more. Let's do Eagle Pose. So Eagle Pose is great for our shoulders. I'm going to turn sideways so you can see what's happening here. Again, my feet are at a good balanced posture, a uh, comfortable distance apart from each other. I'm going to have my right arm swing under my left arm. So I'm twisting them, left elbow is on top, and then I keep twisting, twist, 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 twist. My right hand can grab my left thumb, or I can try to bring the palms together to where you are at today, or maybe, maybe they're just back to back today, and that's okay too. Then move your elbows away from your chest and your hands away from your face. I know it wants to stay really close, but push it away. We're going to bring our weight into our right foot. And then when you're ready, go ahead and try to wrap it around the, uh, wrap your left leg around your right foot. Coming into a little bit of a squat. And again, make the adjustment for your arms. Elbows away, arms away, hands away from your face. more breaths here. And release. Reset. Dance a little bit. Stretch. And let's take it to your other side. Bring your weight into your both feet to start. Left arm under, right above. Twist, twist, twist. Grab a thumb, arms back to back, palms back to back, or palms together. Weight into your left foot, right foot comes up and over. Elbows away from your chest, hands away from your face. Stay with it. One more breath here. And slowly release. Nicely done. Today, that will be all. So go ahead and take some basana. We'll lay down on your mat. Feet out in front of you. Heels apart. Toes flopping out to the sides. Arms wide away from your body with your palms facing up. Closing your eyes, breathing easy. And I'll play Adventure of the Planets for us today.
a little bit of breath, a little bit of motion into your body. Deepen your breath. Let's take two breaths here. Filling up, inhale. Exhale. One more breath in. Exhale and come on to your right side. Staying here for a moment. Soaking up all of the good that you've done for your body and your mind through this practice. And now gently pushing up into a seated position. Finishing the way we started. Bringing the tops of our hands onto our knees, finding ease as we take three breaths together. Inhale. Exhale. Breath in. Breath out. One more. Breath in and exhale. Thank you for joining me today for this practice. Hope to see you again.